Yes, hey there, man. Listen, I have to uh, call you out. Uh, that, that, that just doesn't make any sense. If you, using your scenario, if um, Barack Obama went up head to head, head to head with uh, with Colin Powell, Colin Powell wouldn't stand a chance. Colin Powell lied to the UN to get the Americans into war. Colin Powell's a joke. Colin Powell sold out, man. You know, he's just a soldier. You know what soldiers do? They do what they're told. <coughs> so that that is silly. Um, the thing that I don't get is there's this common thought that Republicans are like, ooh, so bad, and then there's this Republican machine, and they're, all the corporations are in bed with Republicans, and the Democrats are just, oh, just we are the world. They're just holding hands and doing seances and, uh, you know, listen to Peter, Paul, and Mary. Uh, they're, they have, they are nothing. They're, they're just, you know, they're just deer by the, by the babbling, by, by the babbling brook. And that's complete fucking nonsense, man. At the top, they're all the same. Dems, Republicans, what's the fucking difference? Dem Democrats got, con got control in 2006. Is the war over? No. No, it's not. The only Democrats that really stood up and said, uh, started talking real um, subject matter with regards to the, the Iraq war, really, is Dennis Kucinich. He's been saying it from day one. We, fuck, we got to stop the funding. We got to get the hell out of there. This is wrong. So I, Hillary, I think, is a nightmare. Having Hillary as a VP is like having Dick Cheney as a VP. You know? I mean, look around the world. Does anybody really believe that George W. w. Bush has been running the White House for the last eight years? Honestly, do you? I mean, uh, George Bush didn't know his ass from home the ground. I don't know if he still can find it with a fucking map. You know? So... No, I think uh, the trick is on the on the Republican side is to um, July twelfth when uh, millions storm Washington and uh, the Minnesota Convention is overrun with Ron Paul supporters that uh, the Constitution might uh, get some play because Hillary Clinton just more of the same. Hillary Clinton Clinton is uh, John McCain in a friggin' dress. That's it. So, I think uh, best bet uh, VPs for Barack. I, I do agree he should have someone with some experience, but uh, if you want to counter, I guess the military angle, I'd go with uh, either one of either uh, Bob Bowman or um, Jim Webb. Um, Wesley Clark. Dennis Kucinich. There's, there's a lot of great candidates, man. I'd love to see actually Ron Paul on, on the VP ticket. Well, ideally I'd like to see Ron Paul Ron Paul run with uh, Dennis Kucinich VP and uh, and them um, letting people know that uh, if elected, Jesse Ventura will be our uh, Secretary of Defense. That's your best bet for America. So, as I said before, who gives a flying fuck what's good for the Democrat Party? Who cares what's good for the de for the Republican Party? What's best for the 300 million American people? Or more to the point, what's what's more important to the 200 and 70 million American people that are not millionaires. That's what you have to decide. Cheers.